crowd filled the Capitol today for a public hearing on a bill that would punish sanctuary cities. This comes after President Trump's executive order in January that withdraws funding from sanctuary cities that don't cooperate. Valina Jones is live at the Capitol with more on today's hearing. Valina? Well, that's right. A lot of people showed up. In fact, hundreds of opponents were bussed in from all over the state by an immigration advocacy group to voice their opinions about the bill they say would pit immigrants against local law enforcement. They would be in fear all the time. Hundreds of opponents with signs filled the hallways and stairwells of the Capitol to the fourth floor to oppose a bill that would prohibit sanctuary cities. We're not criminals um, like everybody makes us seem. You know, we came here to work, to support our families and everything. We're not here to cause trouble or anything. The Republican-supported bill would prevent local governments from approving policies to prevent enforcement of federal immigration laws. Supporters say its purpose is to target criminals. The other illegals out there that have obeyed the law, the bill doesn't deal with them. These are people who are just bad people. Whether they are illegal or if there are bad people who are legal, I don't want them out on the street. Under the bill, if local governments do not cooperate with immigration authorities, they could lose up to $5,000 of state funding a day. We look the other way for individuals that are repeat violent criminals. It makes absolutely no sense to continue to allow that repeat violent criminal to continue to do what they are doing. Ricardo Torres says the bill would hurt the people who come to America looking for better futures. Y yo puedo decirles que el 90% de esta gente ha ayudado a que este país y sobre todo el estado de Wisconsin continúe creciendo. And I can tell you that about 90% of these people have helped this country to go on and keep developing in the areas of work. Now, the state assembly passed the bill last session. It did not get a full vote in the Senate. A spokesperson for Governor Walker said he would review it if it passes this session. We'll continue to follow it. Valina Jones, live at the Capitol. Thanks, Valina.